What's up, brothers? Today, we are looking at the Freddy action figure that I got for Christmas. Pretty much, if you've been keeping up with the channel, that's my hand. We've been collecting the figures, all of them, all of them. And we've just got another one. Actually, we've got another two, but first of all, we got Freddy. So, we're going to be unboxing this one today. Sorry, spring trap. Um... Let's see how this goes. Um, I'm just gonna get something to cut him out with and I'll be right back. Um, but first of all, I'd just like to say, with getting this figure, I also got the Chica figure so we can, you know, complete the collection. But yeah, I'll be right back. So, I got something to cut him out with. Um, so, pretty much, Let's get to unboxing him. This is going to be quite hard to do. But hopefully... There we go, that should be good enough. So I'm going to try not to damage the packaging too much. Because I want to keep the packaging. So I'm just going to try going around. If you remember... Uh, in one of my last videos. When I did an unboxing. This was always the hardest part for me. Like... Getting, actually getting them out was the hardest part. Mainly because I'm not tr I'm trying not to damage the packaging so it's even harder. Of course, I got more than two for Christmas. I got one for my sister as well. But that one's a Walmart exclusive. And if none of you can't tell, I'm not based in America. So I can't actually get that one. So we had to wait forever for it to come. But it's been a good, lo a bit, it's been a good long break. And we eventually got that one to come from America. There we go. Kind of damaged the packaging quite a lot, to be honest. But it looks a lot. It looks a lot worse in real time. Let me tell you that. Okay, so first of all, of course, we got microphone. Of course, microphone. We got Springtrap's other arm, which is that which just hit the camera. I actually don't know if that hit in frame or not. It literally went straight for the camera. But yep, we'll put that on in a second. Now, here's another hard part because I don't want to damage Freddy. So, we're going to try and cut around. we try cutting around the tie wraps. What? That, I, I just done that with my fingers. That actually wasn't that difficult. Can you actually just do these with fingers? You can. Because they're not like... They're not like hard. So... You can just prop them up. I don't think I'll be able to get that one by using fingers though. I think that one I'm going to have to... I think this one's always been the most difficult when I do one of these videos. This is going to be quite difficult. Here we go. I don't know, about 10 minutes. Actually, it felt like 10 minutes. I had to put him in like this stance, but in the end I ended up cutting this side anyway. Now, let's see if we can get him out without damaging him. There we go. His arm came off. <laughs> oh, I hate... I love these joints, but also hate them.
Okay, let's put that down at the side with the rest of the packaging. So, first glance, Freddy actually doesn't look too bad. He looks like... Of course, we're going to do a side-by-side -side with Golden Freddy in a second, but... To be honest, it actually doesn't look too bad. Like, I think I'd actually choose this one over Golden Freddy, because... Well, it's just, they say it's Freddy, so it's just the main character, for a start. For a second, he just looks a lot better than, than Golden Freddy. I just realised his, um, his microphone was between his feet the entire time. Like, I don't know if it captured on camera because I was holding it a bit up, like, towards him. Um, technically... About, about like here, but he's literally his microphone was like back there and I just only just realized his microphone was there the entire time but anyway are, are, you, are you kidding? are you kidding me? that that actually happened but anyway let's put his microphone in and then let's take a look let's take a look at Freddy in full full Freddiness his microphone is a pain to put in his hand. I got this issue with Golden Freddy as well. His microphone is so hard to put in his hand. Let's try his left hand. His left hand might work a bit better. Ah, his left hand does seem to be a lot more... Yeah, that was, that was manageable. His left hand... I don't know why, but with both of the Freddies, just the left hand seems to work better. And it just seems seems to hold it a lot. I thought I thought Freddy broke then for a second. Like I actually thought one of the ball joints was actually broke. I was I was so concerned then. I'll show you what happened. Technically, the ball joint, it came undone. And his arm was, like, stuck for a second. So I actually thought the ball joint actually broke. Except the ball joints on Freddy here don't seem to work. Are they backwards? Is his hands backwards? Because you can turn his hands. So that means you can turn... Technically, you can turn the ball joints. Is, is, it, is his arms backwards? Because... Let me just get Golden Freddy. Here he is. Here's the, here's the man. So, technically, with Golden Freddy, his arm is, like, bent up this way. But with Freddy here, it didn't do that, because look at the ball joint. Ball joint's back to front on this one. And then ball joint's normal on this one. So, and they also look just a little bit different. And I do know that they reworked these. And I don't know if I got, like, a different version of each one and that's why the ball joints are like backwards but I can just twist his arm around and then twist his hand the right way around but he can't hold his microphone in his right hand and if I'm not mistaken Freddy usually holds it in his right hand um, it's in his left hand right now same with Golden Freddy I couldn't get his microphone in his right hand at first I might be able to do it now but I couldn't at first so what further ado that's technically Freddy that's basically it. Um, the rest of the series I'm going to do on this is going to be recorded on my new camera that I got for Christmas. Because I also got a new camera for Christmas. And it should look either a lot better or a lot worse. I'll do one video. I'll, of course, I'll do this video. And then right now I'll do the next video on my newer. I'm technically recording this on my old webcam. And I'm going to record the next one on my new webcam. And I'll show, and, that, and then you can do a comparison and, oh wait, completely forgot the main part, putting Springtrap's arm on. So, basically, this is the main part that I've waited for. Except his arm, it's always a pain to put these on.
I'd take his other arm off. I'll compare the arms and everything um, off camera, but whenever I move his arm out of that pose, see, it just comes off. Like, I can't move it down. Like, it's a real pain to put on, but then once it's on, I can't move it out of that pose. Although his arm does look a lot different from the other one, that's another reason why I think... Uh, now that I think about it, it doesn't really look that different. But anyway, that's pretty much it. This has been the Freddy action figure video. And the wonky spring trap arm. I really should have done my other figure first so I didn't have to hold him. Yes, if you can guess what it is now by saying other figure. My sister also got me a figure, like I said. So I got another unboxing to do. But we brought this like cabinet to put all the figures in. Only issue is, is that the figures are too tall. And I'm planning on taking one of the shelves out, except it won't look right. But if that's what I have to do, I will do that. But anyway. Um, next video, tomorrow. Tomorrow is going to be the next video. And the next video, I don't really know if it's going to be another unboxing or not. But we'll see, we'll see. Um, I also got a new microphone for Christmas, so that's why the quality is a lot better on my voice. But anyway, without further ado, peace. Uh.